All right, we are here with Bandai Namco Games America at E3 2014. We just announced a brand new Dragon Ball game, Dragon Ball Xenoverse, and we're going to ask some people if they've ever played our games. Have you ever played the Dragon Ball Z games before? I uh, played Budokai way back in the day, and I think one of the recent ones, like last year. What if I told you that the development team behind this new one, Dragon Ball Xenoverse, we just announced that this week, is the same team that did the Budokai games back in the day? That'd be pretty good. I'd give it a chance. I would actually be waiting to see, hear some news about that. Oh, nice. I like the Budokai games. Yeah. What's the word on the street about Dragon Ball games lately? What do people What do people say about Dragon Ball games? They like them. They like the, the diversity of characters now. Um, they're starting to like the, the story modes because you know it's always the same story, but you know the it's getting more free roam to battle. So I think that's what they like the most right now. Have you guys played any of the Dragon Ball Z games before? No. No. Not so much. Were you, have you ever heard of Dragon Ball Z? No. Do <laughs> um, you ever play a Dragon Ball Z video game? No, 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 no. Um, that you can make combos and um, a single player. Yeah. A single player, not just fighting, just okay. single player like a story yep. and all the stuff. Have you ever played any of the Dragon Ball Z video games? Um, no, maybe in middle school. Okay. Uh, would you be interested in playing a new one on next gen? Sure. What, uh, what would you look for in a Dragon Ball game? What, what would be cool for you? Gotta have those balls, those Dragon Balls. <laughs> have you ever played a Dragon Ball Z video game? No. Have you ever played a Dragon Ball Z game? Sure. Hi, so what did you, what did you say? Dragon Ball Z, have you ever played one of those games? It's an awesome game. <laughs> so, we just announced a brand new game, Dragon Ball Xenoverse, this week. What do you think about that? I think it's awesome. Have you guys ever played any Dragon Ball Z games? Yes. Who's your favorite character? Uh, Trunks. Not really. No, but I watch it. Yeah. <laughs> do you play Dragon Ball Z video games? Oh, yeah, I do Budokai 3 for life. Ow. Hey, did you know that there's a new one, Dragon Ball Xenoverse, being developed by the same guys that did Budokai? Really? That's serious. Is, like, literally yeah. one of the best fighting games to be, like, ever. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah, we're dead serious. Get coming out next gen. Definitely. Oh, well, okay. Well, you got that. Okay, this yeah, is you guys. Okay, yeah, this is real. Okay, that's awesome. <laughs> when is it coming out? Uh, no date yet. No date yet? Still working on it? Yes. There's a trailer. There's a trailer? What is it called again? Dragon Ball Xenoverse. X-E-N-O-verse. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Hey, I'll definitely check it out. All right. <laughs> and we are here talking about Dragon Ball Xenoverse. We have Hirano-san, the game producer, and we have Brandon here who's going to translate for us. So our first question is, we, we just announced the game today. What makes Dragon Ball Xenoverse different or special for you guys? So, um, for this Dragon Ball game, the main concept is to create a brand new kind of Dragon Ball Z game experience. Uh, previous Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z games were about enjoying the character, like you would choose a character that you want to play as and enjoy playing as that character. So this time the concept is to create a Dragon Ball Z world, a Dragon Ball Z universe, and have that be um, the method through which you enjoy the game. Dragon Ball Xenoverse. It's not even a Dragon Ball, necessarily a Dragon Ball Z game. It's a Dragon Ball in general game. So what, um, why did you guys make that change? What did you want to uh, bring to the, to, the, to the game with that? As we said before, we want to create a brand new Dragon Ball Z experience with this game. And that means not just the world, but also uh, the story. Uh, so we want to create a game where players can en enjoy the Dragon Ball Z story in a different way than previous games. Previous games kind of just went through the Dragon Ball Z game, the Dragon Ball Z story from the anime, you know, scene by scene, um, as you would expect. So this time, um, we know that there are a lot of people who still want to experience those scenes, and they're going to be able to, but we're going to be able to experience it in a, in a new way. Moving forward with Dragon Ball Xenoverse, there's a lot of very hardcore Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z fans out there, and they're always telling us what kind of games they want and what they want you guys to do. How does that factor into the planning for the game? Have you guys looked at um, feedback from previous games, or have you guys, um, what's your view on community input for this for this particular game? So we definitely um, pay a lot of attention to the feedback we kind of get from fans. We know that there's a lot of um, fans out there who definitely like to make uh, their voices known about what types of things, and we definitely take all that in consider, into consideration as um, we, you know, go on creating our next Dragon Ball game. And we do want to try to include, um, you know, the most kind of uh, desired features and things as, as as much as we can. We are now here with Masahiro Kashino, the Dragon Ball Xenoverse director, and we have a few questions for him. What you 
you're from Dimps, uh, the developer. So you guys have worked on Dragon Ball games, Dragon Ball Z games before for us. What is special and different about this game? What are you most excited about it, coming back to the Dragon Ball Z world? Uh, so yeah, I mean it's been um, you know several years since Dimps has uh, produced a Dragon Ball Z title, but you know since then there's been a lot of advances in technology, um, you know with the with the current gen and the and the next gen systems. So we're looking forward to you know using those features and you know the um, more advanced hardware to create you know a better and even more entertaining uh, Dragon Ball Z experience.